Today's Diet Dirt Diana update was brought to you by the word kerfuffle and also the letter U because really, why do we even need that one? Dirty Diana update. So today's Dirty Diana update is going to contain a copious amount of comedy uh, and I'm going to use a word that was uh, explained to you in a previous uh, version or previous episode of Wade's World called Kerfuffle. So today we're going to give it up to the Canadians. Where are we with the truck? All right, so I don't, I can't remember about our last update. Is the motor in or not? The motor is, as you can see, she is now in. Got a uh, few things that we're waiting on right now. We're waiting on my buddies at Industrial to get me the, um, oh, shh. I friggin' the flange for the downpipe. Thank you very much. Uh, a little bit of comedy today. Uh, so the big joke around the office right now is what is the RPM that we're going to be running at when we command lock up in second or third gear? And uh, this meme uh, has been showing up on the phones and the Snapchat groups. Uh, 47RE converter, lock up go. We're trying down here. Everything's on fire. So probably what's going to happen while we're learning about this motor and this whole setup. So, but that's not even the best part. That's not even the best part. Come on to the back of the truck. Adam and I are going to show you the even better part uh, of the kerfuffling. So now we're going to talk to you about the rear end. This is a really nice rear end. Now listen. Here's what went down with the rear end. So again, a little bit of a backstory on the backstory on the backstory. Uh, myself and Dennis, uh, we're actually not involved in this. We just this is the sales guys that I, that do this. So now that you've got the backstory again, not and not that, that we're perfect by any means, but uh, just want you to know that you know this is a 100% operation of our sales guys uh, you know a lot of pride in it so on and so forth so we've got the rear end getting ready to go in we had kind of designed a mounting uh, plate setup that we wanted to use with the chassis we had the rear end flipped over doing some welding on it and while the rear end was flipped over for the mounting plates to be welded on we took another team of sales guys after the plates were welded on and asked them to simply put the rear end in the truck. Unbeknownst to them, the rear end was completely upside down. So, rear end upside down, it's wrong, doesn't get any wronger. She goes in the truck, she goes in Diana. Diana, this is Diana's maiden voyage of rolling. Okay, so we've got no drive line in here. This is just the rear end was in, she was bolted up, everything is gorgeous, her maiden voyage, off the rack, we roll her out, then she goes outside, and I can't remember what we were gonna do. We were gonna spray something, oh, I, I can't remember. It was, it was something just, just, she was getting outside to get some sunshine. So I walk outside, and I said, like, boys, the rear end's in upside down. Well, what, what, what do you mean the rear end? How do you know the rear end's upside down? Well, I said, well, I can tell you because that pinion on top, that's not right. It needs to be on the bottom. Well, how do you know? Well, I, I just know. Also, the drain plug's on the top. You know what, you know what I mean? I mean, but you, you can think about it in a couple different ways. Maybe we can turn the pumpkin around. Maybe it goes inside, da, da, da. I'm not a Rockwell Rarian expert. I'm just giving it to you in the basics. So they argued, we all argued, blah, 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 blah. Everybody's frustrated. It had taken a long time for them to get it in. Finally, we pulled the caps off the end of it. I turned the pinion. We're going backwards. So Diana's maiden voyage coming down the track, had we not known, would have been real fast out the other end of the fairground. So there we are. The rear end went in upside down. Joke's on us. Here we are. But it's all part of the learning experience. Comedy. We talk about, you know, <laughs> truck pullers keep their keep their cars to their chest. I guess the thoroughbred team, when we get to the track near you, we're probably going to be a whole lot of a different group because there's going to be a hell of a lot of laughing, I promise you. Even if we're doing, I can just promise you there's going to be a lot of laughter. So there's your Dirty Diana update. Check back in with us. Something else may get put in upside down. I can't promise anything. Thank you.